today's video. Now, years ago, I had dark under eye circles. Dark under eye circles that I normally covered with makeup. I keep covering, 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 covering. However, when I removed the makeup, it was still there. It also let me look a bit older. My eyes were looking a little dull. And I tried so many different products on my skin. Nothing seemed to work. Sometimes I try products, they work for a while, and then it would come all back. However, I did my research and I stumbled up on this amazing herb known as parsley. I have been using the parsley leaf, mixing with other ingredients on my under eyes now for a couple of years, and this is what works for me. So what I'm going to do for you today, I am going to show you how to use the parsley to make a eye gel. This gel will have to clear the under eyes. It will also have to reduce wrinkles and fine lines. And if you have dry under eyes, this will help. It is also good for puffy eyes and eye bags. Now remember, everyone is different. So the fact that it works so well for me, it might not do the same for you. But what do you have to lose? Absolutely nothing. What do you have to gain? Clear on their eyes. Let me stop talking. Let's jump in the kitchen and whip this up really, really quick. For this recipe, you're going to need a blender and you're also going to need a strainer. Our first ingredient is parsley and parsley contains vitamin K. Parsley also contains vitamin C. It is good to use to get rid of dark on the eye circles. It is also good for puffy eyes and eye bags. Now, parsley is also a good source of calcium, iron, magnesium. Therefore, it contains all the electrolytes. And the way the electrolytes works on the skin is that it helps to lock the moisture in the skin. So we're going to be preparing the parsley. And we're using about a few sprigs of the parsley. Now here we have the parsley leaves and the first thing we're going to do, we're going to make sure to wash them thoroughly. We're using both the leaves and the stem for this recipe. So wash your parsley leaves. Now once your parsley leaves have been washed, what we're going to do, we're just going to use our hands to kind of break them up in small pieces. Just crush them a bit. Now once this is done, we're going to reach for our blender and we're going to add the parsley leaves to the blender, both leaves and stem. Add this to the blender. Now once this is done, let's reach for our second ingredient. Our second ingredient is some rose water. And rose water will help to hydrate the skin. Rose water is also good to use as a toner on the skin. And when mixed with the parsley, it will help to clear dark on the eyes, eye bags, and puffy eyes. So I'm using about two tablespoons of the rose water. Pouring this in with the parsley leaves. And now we're going to cover... Give our blender a little shake to shake things down, and we're gonna blend. Now take a look, this is what we have after blending, and now we're gonna strain. Make sure to get everything out. And now we're just gonna whisk this. And now here we have our parsley juice, and this is what we're gonna use to make our eye a job. So we need about a tablespoon or so of the parsley juice, and let's measure this. So one tablespoon of our parsley mixture, pour this in. Next we're reaching for some aloe vera gel, and aloe vera gel will have to clear dark pigmentation on the skin. It's good for hydrating the skin and it's good to use under your eyes to help to get rid of under eyes circles and eye bags. So we're using one tablespoon of the aloe vera gel. Pour this in. 
make sure to get everything out. Whisking the two together. So we're mixing aloe vera gel and parsley juice and rose water. Completely dissolve the aloe vera gel in the mixture. So mix well. Once this is done, we're going to reach for our next ingredient. And here I have some cucumber oil. This is optional, however. You can choose to use the cucumber oil in the mixture, or you can choose to use the cucumber oil above this. I'm going to add about a teaspoon of the cucumber oil in the mixture, pour this in. Now here we have our next ingredient, which is a vegetable glycerin, and we're using it as a preservative, but it also helps to moisturize the skin. I'm using about a teaspoon of the vegetable glycerin, pour this in. And now we are gonna mix, and we are gonna mix well. We have parsley and rose water, we have aloe vera gel, we have cucumber seed oil, and we also have vegetable glycerin. Now, if you do not have cucumber seed oil, a good substitute is some sweet almond oil, which is good for dark on the eye circles. You can also choose to use avocado oil or even some marula oil. Now, once this is totally blended together, you can clearly see how jelly-like this is. For this recipe also, I suggest you use a store-bought aloe vera gel instead of the fresh. If you use the fresh aloe vera gel in this, I also would suggest that you leave it on for a couple of hours and then you rinse off. If you use the store-bought, you can apply it at night like this is. Leave it on overnight and wake up with clear under eyes. So now let's reach for our storage jar. And we're going to pour our parsley gel in, very, very jelly-like. And this is even going to get more thick when you place it in the refrigerator. So here you have your dark circle remover, eye bags, and puffy eye gel. For this remedy, you're going to use it under your eyes at night. So you're going to take a little bit of the remedy. This is what I use. You're going to apply it under your eyes and you're going to massage it under your eyes. It's also very hydrating, so massage it on the both eyes. And don't forget to take it all the way to the crow's feet. This is also good to use in your laugh lines. Once this is done, you're going to let it dry, go sleep with it. Upon arising in the morning, you rinse off. Now store this in your refrigerator for ten, 7 to 10 days or so. When it is done, make a new batch. This can be used, however, on your skin AM and PM. If you're using it um, AM, just take a little bit and let it dissolve in the skin. It is also good to use under your makeup. So here you have an amazing gel for dark under eye circles, puffy eyes and eye bags. Now, if you want to know if this can be used over your entire face, yes, it can because it have wrinkle fighting properties and it also has skin lightening properties. So there you have it, an amazing gel for your skin overall. Now here we have our eye gel and all you need from this is two drops, okay? I suggest that you pour this in a bottle, preferably with a spray pump or, you know, because you don't want to contaminate, so do not dip. So all we need from this is two drops. Let's pour this out. And that's it. And here it is, two drops. Now you've got to use clean hands for this, okay? Clean hands. And I also suggest that you cleanse the area around your eyes. I have several videos, which I will link one below, exactly how to keep the under eyes really clean. And then you're going to take your finger and you're going to dab this under your eyes. And notice that I am dabbing it in a dabba 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 this is because i am also putting circulation by massaging the remedy under my eyes so apply it under your eyes 
and as I said, preferably at night. And this is also good for the crow's feet. It helps to get rid of wrinkles and fine lines. I also like to use this remedy to put in my laugh lines. So apply it and let it dry under on their eyes. And once it is dry, you're gonna sleep with it up on the rising, you rinse off. This is good to use on a regular, okay? However, for me, how it works on my skin is fade the dark on the eyes. And from time to time, as a matter of fact, I'm always making it to help to keep my under eyes clear and also free from wrinkles. So go ahead and give it a try. If you like it, use it for at least six weeks or so, and then come back and leave a comment. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye.